Hey everyone, this is a tutorial video. I wanted to show you how to put ad blocking on your Android tablet. It was a while back. I, I've used ad block on my computer for a while. I didn't use it for a while, but then I started using it again. I actually ended up liking it. And when I rooted a, a tablet of mine a while ago, it came with ad blocker called Adaway on it. And then when I got this tablet, it wasn't rooted. And I looked in the Play Store. You can't find it in the Play Store. So I'm going to show you how to find it. You can uh, go with whatever you want, like Adblock or Attaway. I tried both. Right now, I'm using Attaway, but I haven't experimented enough to see which one I like more. Nice if I could type that. Yes. So you, I already have Attaway installed, so let's just type in Adblock for it. It's kind of hard to type to the viewfinder. And then you go straight to their website and you can just install it from there. Now the thing is, I believe with Adblock, you don't have to be rooted, but it's recommended that your tablet is rooted. And I know with Attaway, which is what I'm using now, it does a requirement is your tablet needs to be rooted. So I would suggest just trying Adblock if you're not rooted and seeing if it works. But for me, I like Attaway better. I think it works a little better. So, let's go let's get rid of that notification. Download. I use ES File Explorer. I think it's a little bit cleaner than using Chrome's. And hopefully, you can see this good because I don't have screen capture software for my tablet. And then you'll just go to install. So you open the file, and then you should see Cancel Market Install, go to Install, and then just say Install. And it's basically just like the Play Store because it's an eight. When you go to, um, when you go to the Play Store, it's just the same process. Like the APKs are there, and they're just maintained. Well, you can download them just the same way via the internet, as long as you get that APK file and have a file manager. So then if I check my app drawer, you'll see Attaway, which this isn't the app we just downloaded, so don't get confused if yours doesn't look like this. This is what I, I had on my old tablet, and I liked it. I tried uh, Adblocker, or Adblock, I'm getting the names mixed up. And I don't know, I just like, I thought this one blocked a few more ads, but you can experiment with both. So then, so you have Adblock. This, I don't know, I don't think it'll give me any errors for having both ad blocks on. I'll un uninstall this one when I'm done. You'll want to make sure it's on, and then you'll see you're going to get a notification. You don't get that with Adaway, but with ad block you do. So you have to hide icon, and then you'll have to go to show me, and go in here. Because it's still technically there, you just can't see it. It's like the icons are removed, but it still takes the space, so your notifications will be a little farther off. So just click uncheck show notifications and then it doesn't show up in your drop down or your tray again if you do uh, add away that won't happen you can check off acceptable ads there's no ads that's how simple it is hopefully that helped you I didn't even know like I, I just wasn't thinking I forgot you can do that you don't need to download everything from the play store because I don't allow ad blockers I guess anymore hopefully that helped you and if uh, you have any questions just leave them in the comments below so thanks for watching.